guys, Junior, this is Team Metalworks coming at you with another uh, little video today. Today we're doing a little tool review. That's right, the Harbor Freight 3.8 18 volt cordless drill. We got her. Special, $19.99. Under 20 bucks. Uh, of course, not counting tax and everything. So, why, why, as a metal fabricator guy, Ed, do I have this? I mean, some of you guys are looking at me going, why, why did he buy a $20 drill? But there's a few things going on in uh, SOT Metalworks' household. Uh, the daughters have moved out. Uh, one of them's got their own apartment. Uh, this is kind of a test. I bought a $20 drill to see if this would help her out. So I'm going to get one for the wife. going to get one for the daughter if this uh, kind of does okay. All they're going to be doing with it is hanging picture frames, uh, putting together some Ikea furniture, stuff like that. But I also want to know if this would even possibly work down here in the metal fabrication shop uh, when I need to drill some metal, drill some wood, whatever it may be. So we're going to run a one inch bit uh, in this joker, which is not very sharp by the way, I'm just going to let you guys know on a non-treated two before see what happens there also got some uh, quarter inch uh, flat stock we're going to run a 3 8 drill bit through it see what happens with it see just what the comparability is on say some of my dewalt stuff uh you guys know i'm a firm believer in DeWalt. i like it uh and the reason i like it's because i have batteries for it so uh this is the cheap one off ebay uh feels pretty comparable to that i'll be honest uh, but this is all the old tested tried and true dewalt so this one's worked pretty good over the years used and abused them quite a bit so anyway back to the drill master 18 volt here uh first looks i mean it's it's cheaply built i i kind of understand they got the uh, fake chrome going on up here it does have i believe it said 21 settings uh, if I'm not mistaken, something like that. It's crazy. Yes, 21 torque clutch settings. Hmm, that's uh, very interesting. Uh, you never know when you may need all those, but. Hmm, 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 hmm. Let's get around drill and see what happens. Hmm, hmm. This is a fully charged battery, uh, supposedly. Uh, that's what the little telltale charger told us. Comes with the charger. Of course, you got the, uh, the adapter and everything. Uh, seems to work fairly good. It charged up. Uh, it says it's got a charge time of like uh, three hours or something. Uh, three to five hours, maybe something in the neighborhood. Yeah, three to five hour charger. Seemed like it charged up a little faster than that. I don't know how dead it was uh, coming from the factory. Normally, these things don't have much of a charge on them whatsoever, but we, we shall see. So we're going to run her through her paces here on a couple things. It seems like it's going to do the job I needed to do. I don't know if it's going to do the job I needed to do in the shop. Uh, only time would be able to tell on that, but I think the wife and the daughter would be happy in the very small, minute projects they have. That's kind of what it's geared towards. If you've got a uh, somebody going to college, somebody, I mean, somebody getting their own place, stuff like that, 20 bucks seems like a really great deal for a drill that works to put small furniture together, some screws in a wall, whatever it may be. I think it's a... It's a pretty respectable thing, but I know it's not going to work down here for, for very long, probably. So let's see if we can uh, drill through this metal and drill through this 2 before. see if we burn it up, see if anything smokes, and then we may, maybe we'll go over the features of this drill just a little bit more, see what happens. All right, guys, got our uh, pine 2 before in here. Uh, this would maybe replicate something you're going to have to do in the apartment or a piece of furniture needs a cord put through it or something. Just, 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 just bear with me, bear with me. So, well, like I said, one inch paddle bit, not extremely sharp. This one's been used a couple times, not, not a whole lot, but let's see if, uh, if she's got the gusto to go with the one inch. She didn't like it, but she did it. Not, uh, not too shabby, not too shabby. You could uh, probably hear in the video there that uh, yeah, we were uh, getting with it a little bit, uh, a little bit too much. I'll be honest, uh, just uh, not a lot of, 
not a lot of oomph there uh, for this cheap drill, but you're not buying it to uh, drill with all day long. You're buying it to uh, get by, either get better tools or working on some well, furniture or whatever it may be. So I think it would be really good for that. So let's drill through some uh, quarter inch flat stock. See how long that takes. This could turn into a 15 minute video. <laughs> All right, so what do we got here? We've got a brand new 3H drill bit, brand spanking new, right out of the box, you guys can see. So uh, one thing I found, I thought I was in drill mode a while ago. It was off just a touch. I could not tell, uh, but I really uh, poured a good to it there and uh, got it over on, on the drill mark. It's just extremely, extremely tough to get it over there where it belongs. You heard it click that time. I didn't hear it click earlier, but that is uh, one thing, you know, with a $20 drill, it's it's going to be a little, uh, hmm, a little iffy here and there, but all right. <laughs> Let's give her the goods, see what happens. All right, here we go. Three eighths drill bit through quarter inch steel with the uh, Drillmaster 18 volt Harbor Freight drill. Uh oh, it's gonna take a while. Not doing terrible, not doing bad. Not doing great either, though. Shavings are coming out fairly nice. I'm having to pour the goods to it, though. I'm going to let you know. Uh-oh. The battery's about to give up the ghost. <laughs> Well, it made it. She didn't like it. The battery's about gone in it. But, uh, well, she did. She did make it. She's not. I'll be honest, guys. I, I thought this joker would be. I mean, I was bearing down on her pretty good. I thought this thing would be so hot you couldn't touch it. That's what a $20 drill would normally do. Uh, battery life, uh, you know, not, not not so so there seemed like she was uh, running on empty right as we got to the end but you can see through that quarter inch hole there it's it's a pretty good uh, pretty good deal these are really really good drill bits uh should have done better we'll run one through uh with a dewalt here and see how it does see if it's you know comparable in any way shape or form and see what happens all right got the dewalt old trusty this thing has been used and abused. Little, uh, little bit of difference there. Just a little bit of difference, but that's expected. With, uh, I don't know. I think back in the day, this this drill was. I was wanting to say like 140 hours or something like that. It, it may have been a little more at the time, but that uh, it made short work of it compared to the uh, drill master. But you know, twenty dollars versus all this over here uh, and the weight. I mean, this one doesn't weigh anything. This one is heavy, heavy, heavy. You know what? This one did get a little warmer, but not extremely much more than what this one did. Uh, I'm really kind of kind of surprised about that. I'll be, I'll be honest. Hi right, guys, what do we think about the almighty drill master? Well, let's go over a few things. Really surprised it didn't get hotter drilling that uh, 3 8 inch hole than what it did through that quarter inch metal. Uh, that was kind of impressive for me for a $20 drill. I figured this thing would have been just about catching on fire. Yes, we did have a brand new bit. Yes, you know, things were working pretty good um the one is bit paddle bit that that kind of impresses me because you know not not all drills really do well with those not uh i'm not saying this is a great drill by any means i'm saying it's a good drill uh if you've got some small house projects home projects that you're doing by all means hammer down and get you one of these hang your pictures put your ikea furniture together 
You know, those kids' toys nowadays, I tell you what, they, there's so many parts and pieces of those jokers. Everybody needs a decent drill in the house, and this is gonna do that kind of stuff. Is this drill gonna be down here uh, working day in and day out? Uh, is it gonna be your house, you know, building decks and screwing three inch screws in all the time? No, it's, it's, it's not gonna do that. Will it do a few of them? It'll do a few of them, but it, it, it won't do it all day. Uh, one, the battery's not gonna hold up. I can already tell the battery loses charge pretty ricky tick. Um, you know, that, that quarter inch was pretty stout, but it shouldn't have drained the battery that bad. Uh, this is one you're gonna have to keep the charger close at all times uh, and keep it plugged up on a regular basis, I believe. But the drill handled the couple things we did with it just fine. Uh, overall, it, it, it's it's got a little bit of a Chinese, Japanese uh, plastic smell to it. You guys know the smell. The plastic I'm kind of thinking about, it's, uh, you can always smell it. It's, you, you really know where this thing was made, I'm sure. But, uh, Chuck, like I said, it was giving us a few problems up there. It's not too tremendously terrible now. Uh, you know, once we got our uh, settings and everything kind of lined out where they should be, we were good there. Uh, buttons are free. They, uh, left, right, you know, the trigger pull's not, not terrible. I mean, it's got a little LED light there, which I didn't even notice because I couldn't see it. You guys check that out. It's not real bright, barely noticeable. Hey, but you know, that's that's another uh, another aspect, another good thing. Not uh, taking the battery in off and on is a little 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 rough. Expect it with a twenty dollar drill. It's twenty bucks, guys. It's twenty bucks. I mean. You, uh, you can't get one of these for $20 uh, because this one's been around and it's probably so long ago it was discontinued. It's not even funny. But for 20 bucks, Harbor Freight's got them right now. Not a bad deal, guys. Drill Master, like I said, 18 volt, 3 inch drive. Uh, comes with a charger, comes with one battery. I'm sure you can buy other batteries. Didn't look on the website about other batteries. I would say if you're going to use it very much at all, that's that's probably, probably a good, uh, good purchase with it. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's not bad. It's a, it's a little slow. 900 RPM is a little bit slow compared to the Dewalt. Uh, the cut speed on this Joker is is fairly slow. Uh, there again, expect it with a twenty dollar drill. Uh, I I mean I'm gonna buy one of these for the wife, and I'm gonna buy one of these for the daughter, and I think they're gonna take care of those home projects on a regular basis. It's gonna free me up to do stuff down here, and uh, yeah, it should work out all the way around. But I'll be honest, there's been several times where I didn't want to have to walk all the way to the garage, pick up my drill, and go back to the house, do what I need to do with the home projects. Where we can keep this one in the house now, it can be squared away. If I've got some big stuff going on, I'll come get the big drill. But uh, hanging pictures and putting furniture together and stuff like that, I think it's going to work extraordinarily well. It's going to be a, it's going to be a good tool. Harbor Freight has some good stuff. They don't have some great stuff. They've got some good stuff. But... Uh, Item number 62873, in case you guys want to order that. There's the box, up close and personal, Drill Master, 18 volt cordless, 3 8 uh, 3 to 5 hour uh, charge time. Like I said, 21 torque settings, um, variable speed 0 to 900 RPMs, which is a little slow. That's a little slow. But overall, I think it would be a fine and dandy drill for a starter drill, for the wife one in the house, for the daughter one in the apartment, for the son in the apartment, whatever it may be. I think it's a good, fairly good deal for 20 bucks. Can't beat it. So if you guys have any bad issues with any of these and you've bought one or what have you, leave us a comment down below to let us know. That way we know what to be looking for, what uh, what not to do to them. You know, don't use them as a hammer and, and, and all the fun stuff. So let us know guys keep us informed that's what we're here for all right guys we're gonna cut on out of here hopefully you guys didn't mind the video too bad don't normally do tool tool reviews uh normally we, normally we are cnc plasma table on it as you can see behind me so i got some more signs to cut out i got a little painting to do i gotta get back to work before the boss comes down here and finds me jibber jabbering on this camera all right we're gonna cut on out of here hope y'all being safe y'all remember work smarter not harder we'll catch y'all later y'all have a good one